Hi again guys, um, today I'm just going to quickly do my outfit of the day and face of the day. So I'm still wearing my like pyjama shorts on the bottom so I'm just going to do the top half. This stripy tank top with the navy stripes is from River Island and it's one of those long ones. So you could, technically if you have quite a shorter, like a shorter torso, you could wear it with leggings, but I have quite a long torso, so I just have to wear it with jeans. Um, and then for jewellery, I have this blue, I don't know what it is, it might be like a sapphire or semi precious stone, something like that, that my mum bought at a jewellery show and then she got it like set and got a chain for it, something like that. And then this, I don't remember where it got it from, but it's like a little... Cluster necklace with a little fake pearl, um, angel wing, a key, and a little ballet pump that's really cute. So that's my jewelry. And then on my wrist I have my the same like Christian bracelet I wore yesterday. And this red leather bracelet that I got in Barcelona and my white Michael Kors watch. Okay, so onto my face. Oh my hair is just I haven't brushed it today, so it's like really wavy because I had it like tied up half of the morning in a bun so I took it down it was more wavy and I really like this look and I just did um, an all-over spray with like a Charles Wor Worthington shine spray just to give my hair a bit of shine and to keep this I like this um sort of swept back look so I, I sprayed that in to kind of give it a little bit of hold even though that's not what it's for so on my cheeks I have oh, let's start with my eyes on my eyes I have this um, neutral brown look and as a base all over my lid I have NARS Cairo which is this color really pretty that color and then blend it into the crease you can see I used the one of the colors from my Dior Earth Reflections palette and it's the darkest brown color here and what I did was um, I just let's see okay I just blended I started here at the edge of my eye and I blended up where my crease would be because I'm Asian I don't really have a crease so I just sort of if you feel your eye you can feel where um, your eye socket goes in and that's where you want to do the um, crease color so you just blend it in inwards and that's what I did and then I blended it all out on the top with like some MAC Brulee eyeshadow which is just, just a light cream skin co skin tone color and then for mascara I'm using my Max Factor Masterpiece Max which I really like um, I said in my makeup collection video that it's basically the same as sorry just checking time it's basically the same as my um, Giorgio Iconic, except this is much cheaper. I think this is um, probably like £10, and Dior shows like 20 I think. So that's the brush. It's one of those synthetic brushes, and it's basically a smaller version of the Max Factor False Lash Effect brush, if you've seen that. Um, so it separates really well, it doesn't clump, and it's really buildable. So with one coat, you've got like a natural daytime look, but I like to do two coats because I like my lashes to look more voluminous so that's what I have on today um, as for my cheeks I used my Benefit 10 bronzer again so I used both the bronzer side and the highlighting side and then for blush I used Benefit Coralista which is this really pretty it comes with a brush as well like all of the Benefit box powders and it's this really like pretty bright coral pink color um, I know that on most people it comes out like a true coral, so it's kind of peachy, but on me, it's more like a light pink, so with a, it's like a light warm pink on me, it's not at all peachy on me, um, so you can see it there. Um, Illamasqua Lover comes out as a true peach on me. So that's all for today. Um, Tomorrow or tonight I might do like my favorite eyeshadows or something like that or go through my blush collection. So yeah, have a great day everyone. Bye.